Hey sports fans, you are watching Hop is Hip Tips. Thank you so much for joining me, Hip Hop, today for some hot, steamy EFC action. And, uh, yeah, continuing on with our junks and our vortex, trying to get some plus pills done. We'll probably finish that mission today, and then I'm going to switch out my deck here. But, um, anyway, yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be some fun. So buckle up. Buckle up for the ride, baby. Alrighty, so... Looks like we have some uh, new bloods coming Friday. That's exciting. Um, and, uh, so I was using Miss Jiggy. I've been using Miss Jiggy. And I actually, I beat a guy's deck with her. And I, dr I had a draw with a Roots deck. Of course, if I'd had Miss Jiggy, I probably would have won that draw, but that's okay. Uh, I think she's doing pretty well so far. So, we're 79th of Polit Arena with 270 points. Can we break into EFC Tower today? I mean, Z Palace? Probably not, because it looks like General Bose there has 564 points, and he hasn't cracked Z Palace yet. But anyway, let's get on to game one, baby. See what kind of damage we can do here. The other swap I was thinking the other day of making was um, Sea Wing for Bubblegum. But Bubblegum actually proved to be key in a couple battles yesterday. So, I think we're good. We're fighting Lady Beaks. A master level 52. Lady Beaks. Let's turn on our auto zoom here. So Lady Beaks has an has a a handful of riots here. So who's she gonna play first? That's the question. And who do I want to play first, for that matter? If she throws Geo. She doesn't. She throws Alexandria. Uh, she's going to need Alexandria for damage, though, isn't she? Um, so let's go 43 attack with Timonoff. And if she goes more than that, well, she goes more than that. Oh, sweet. So we blast her. She gets a pill back, we get a pill back. And uh, she's down one life. We have the same number of pills, and I'm doping, baby. Doping like a fiend. Alright, so, um, next up, we don't want to use Exodus, do we? So, let's use Callie. Should we use Callie? Um,. Yeah, we're gonna have to use Cali here. With two pills. We'll see if Geo jumps on this. Or if he hits me with Daphne. I guess he could even take it with Harmonia, I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. So yeah, he's definitely not using the best Riot's cards, that's for sure. So he blasts me for two with Harmonia? That was weird. Why would he, why would you do that? I don't, I don't get that at all. That was bizarre. So he throws Geo, and I'm just going to take it like a man. To get some pills back with Carrie. Carrie's kind of nice. She's like one of the, uh, she's one of the only defeat plus pills cards now that doesn't have like a max on it. So, um, so I like that about her. All right, time to destroy Daphne now. We're going to use all but one pill just for fun. 
Just for the F of it, just for the fun of it. Take that, lady beaks. Booyah! Exodus coming in hard and fast. And you can have your plus 16 attack. I don't care. Coming in fast and furious. The Exodus for the win, baby. Nice. So I pick up 21 points there. And uh, we're on to game 2 of 10, baby. 2 of friggin' 10. So this is uh, Bortuk, a Colossus level 71. What's up, Bortuk? He was, uh, he's been pretty active in the Season 26 thread. Uh, suggesting ways that we can fix the uh, current ELO system. So, let's see if we can beat Vortec here, or Bortuk. Beat Bortuk with my Vortex. How about that? Um, let's see. I need to go first. And I think we're just going to go, I don't know, should we toss Miss Jiggy first? Or should we throw Kali? Kali doesn't have her growth going yet. Let's throw Miss Jiggy. That's cool. I'm just going to go... Um, we'll, we'll three pillar there. Or four pill as the case may be. Don't want to go too hard with her. Um, maybe we'll get some pills out of these guys. Oh, he throws Hawkins. Oh, what? No way. Dang. You didn't pill enough there, son. So uh, we get a couple pills back from Miss Jiggy. And Hawkins gets dumped on. And we get a nice six damage in there. So now he throws Wraith. And let's see, do I want to use Predator against Wraith? Or do I want to use Predator against... I guess I need to use Predator here. So, um, we'll one pill. One pill against the Wraith Meister. Oh, suck it, Wraith. Booyah! There's another four. So that's excellent. And now what? Um, well, now we just split our pills, basically. That's, that's pretty simple. Pretty simple. When you have your opponent down a ton of life and you both have the same number of pills, you split your friggin' pills, baby. It's what you do. And there you go. Oh, and he leaves like a little bitch. Fine, leave. Don't let me get my Don't let me get my blink points, jerk off. Alright. Well, two wins in a row. I'm liking it. Heading into game three. And this is Thionis, a Colossus level 100. And he has a couple of roots and a couple of um, freaks. A couple of freaks. So, let's see here. I forgot Fraggle was a freaks. Do I have Fraggle? I'm not sure I have Fraggle. He's, he's a pretty decent freaks card, I guess if you like that kind of thing. Here comes Gretchen. He's going to try to get his heal life on, apparently. And what are we going to do about that? I guess we'll throw bubble gum with a couple pills. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> he perfect pilled us. Ouch. Could have, should have just gone one more pill there. Oh well. So he gets his he gets his heel going. We get a couple pills back. And now, now I'm gonna throw Kali with um. I'm gonna throw Kali with two pills. So what you gonna do, bro? You gonna throw Arturo at me? Because if you don't, you're not gonna get your growth minus one power. 
So just think about that. Think long and hard about that. Nope, he throws Rico. And he just takes it like a man. Boom. So that's excellent. So now what? Now he has revenge stop ability on Fraggle. Who cares? And Arturo is going to be a 7 power the rest of the way here. So... I just, yeah, really, I just have to beat Arturo, right? That's pretty much the deal. So, uh, Exodus. I don't know, though. Let's see. If I hit for six here. No, that won't work, will it? I gotta go like this. No, actually, I can't win. I can't win unless I do this. Sweet. So let's see if that wins it for me. Fraggle is a, an 80, and I'm a 77. Nope, that doesn't win it for me. But we did win, uh, we, we did do Weekly Legend 1 here. So that's nice. What do we get? Replay. Okay, um, so dang, Fraggle hits us for two, we go down to seven, he goes up to ten, ouch, good game Thionis, that was a pretty good game, we're going to get a dick ton of pills there. Not that it matters, we just finished the weekly legend mission anyway. So, minus 30 points, dang it. And uh, I need to switch my deck up, so hold on a second. Alright, so we're back now with, um, with a new deck, a life gain deck. Um, still junks, but we replaced our vortex with some fang pee. So... What do I want to do? What do I want to do here? I guess we throw Khan. Go 32 attack. Is that enough? Yeah, that'll work. Throw our 8 powered card here before Marlin has confidence. Oh wait, that doesn't matter, does it? Conf he has confidence power plus 5. Never mind. Throw our Khan here. And um, if we get through, we hit for eight. If not, we'll get some life back. So we're fighting Deluxor Edo, a guru level 66. And he tosses Hammerlock at me. Oh, no way. See a hammerlock. Booyah. So we're down three pills, but we uh, we got a nice eight life gap going in our favor here. So that's delish. It's probably going to throw Fastbender now. We'll just take it with Tanak. So he hits us for three. And uh, basically he got a free three damage in there, but whatevs. Um... Now what? Now... Now we're going to throw Defunk, and um, he has Marlin activated. So we're just going to one pill on our Defunk here. See if that uh, wins the game for us. He throws Marlin. How many pills does he spend? Mmm. Was it enough? I'm not thinking it was enough. 
That was definitely not enough. Holy crap. Dang it. So sh we should have gone harder with the funk there, apparently. Oh, that was brutal. Dang. It was an awesome first round, and then he just then we just lost it after that. Minus 31 points. Good game, Deluxe or Edo. Ouch. That hurt a lot, actually. So we're on to game 5 of 10 with 2 wins and 2 losses. 2 ugly losses, though. So we lost more than we gained so far. This is Laugh Meme from... Uh, I don't know what that, that guild is. Laugh? Uh, anyway, he's an Eternal, level 149. And he has 3 Piranhas and a PR Vronxed here. And he tosses Hawkins Noel. I could just take it with Kusuri, but um, it doesn't seem like it would be in my best interest. So we're going to toss Defunct here with 42 attack. Excellent. So we open up a 6 life gap here. Now we'll throw Tanak with no pills. Maybe he'll take it with Bonnie. Maybe he'll blast me with Selma. I just don't know. Just don't know what'll happen. It's exciting, isn't it? So, uh, oh, so he blasts us with Bonnie for one for one damage. Excellent. That's hilarious. So now I assume he'll throw Selma here. And obviously I can't beat her with either of my cards. And right about now he's calculating exactly how many pills he needs to use with Selma. Right? So let's see, PR Vronxed can beat Cubic. Cubic is a 7 times 8, which is 56 which is actually 64. So Bronx needs to be a 9 times 8, which is 72. And he has 11 pills here. So he can go down to, what, 7 pills? Is that right? No, he can go down to 6 pills. I don't know, I can't figure it out. Fetch. Um, let's see, so he has 11 pills right now. He needs to have 8 when he's finished. So if he goes down to 6 and gets 2 more, that's 8, right? So... So 7 times 5. Right? We'll do that instead. Oh, wow. Okay. But he gets two pills back, so let's see here. He's a 9 times 4, which is 36. And I am probably not enough. Oh no, I'm a 36. But, he's a 3 star. Damn it. Ugh. Holy cow. Should have won that one. Totally should have won that one. We lose another 32 points. Ugh. This is sucking. This is sucking royally. All right, on to game six of ten with three losses and two wins today. Not doing so hot. Definitely not doing so hot. 
So this is X uh, Mikolachak, a guru level 45. And he's also using piranhas here, full hand of piranhas. So he tosses Scub here. And, um, hmm. Yeah, screw that. Nah. Let's throw Mamba with, um, 40 attack. How about that? See if we can steal that 5 damage. Okay, that's decent. So blast him for 5. Now he has Triton activated. So, um... Well, let's 2 pill Kusuri here. Triton. Excellent. We caught him with his pants down. Beauty. Beauty. So, now what? Now he throws Calder. Let's see, Calder is a 6 times 9, which is 30. No, 9 times 6 is 54. So I would minus 12 that down to a 42. Yeah, it's not going to be enough, is it? Um, we'll do that. Nice. Suck it, Calder. Booyah! We get blink points, and we get the friggin' win, baby. What you got, Kristen? No confidence? That's what I thought. Defunct's got a little something for you. It's called a fat beat. Except he loses, but you know, what else? Take five, and that's game, baby. 25 points, Exolande. We're on to game seven of 10. This is Biddlejuice, a Colossus level 105. And we fought him before. I, I can't remember who wins usually. But um, he has three ghost towns and a death legend. She can definitely be an honorary ghost town. And I have an even split of Junks and Fang P. So let's see who comes out on top here. I'm not liking Calamity at all. Of course, Tanak can, can handle Calamity pretty nicely, can't, can't he? Okay, he's doing all sorts of stuff on his nightmare mansion there. Uh, so he throws Bambino here. Um, so I need to I need to throw Defunk. Unfortunately, he's going to minus one my power and damage, but that can't be helped. So I'm just going to two pill Defunk here, relying on my bonus, and it doesn't carry me all the way through. So we take four there. Uh, so now what? Now we're going to throw Kusuri here with. Um, and two pill kusuri. Because I don't want Calamity hitting me. So we're going to play Kusuri and Tanak on our reprisal rounds here.
So I don't know, his um, his ghost town bonus is probably going to sink me pretty hard here. I don't have a whole lot of damage I can throw at him. Especially against Sue. Like, you beat Sue and it doesn't even matter, you know what I mean? So what you gonna do, Biddle Juice? Come on, bro, you got Kusuri coming at you. Okay, so he did throw Calamity, that's good. We got her out of the way. Of course, Tanaka and Blink both handle her kind of nicely. So, oh well. So now I just, I think I just, I need to beat Blink, uh, Death Legend with Blink is what I need to do. She's got minus 8 attack, and I have minus 16. So she can be a 6 times 9, which is 54. That will be a 6 times... 42, 50... Like that, right? So it's just one pill to knack here. I think I lost though, pretty much. Takes me down to four, and that's game. But we will pick up some nice blink points here. So yeah, I got brutalized on that one. Lose 24 points. Ouch. Alright, sports fans. Game 8, baby. Let's do this. Let's do this. So, um, let's see. This is Mr. Palavo, a guru level 75. He has three Frozens and an El Matador. And, um... Yeah, I've said it before, Fang P just doesn't have a lot of good life gain cards. Um, Kusuri and Khan are really the only two that I that I like to use from Fang P. And of course I have there is a Fang P mission that is um, let's see we'll go forty attack here with Mamba. See if we can steal El Matador's five power. Nice. So we hit for seven there. Egg Solande. I'm gonna one pill Kusuri here. Actually, I should have thrown Tanak, shouldn't I? Yeah, I should have thrown Tanak. That would have been better against Sabrinak. But oh well. And he does throw Sabrinak. How many pills does he use? Six pills. And get six back. So that was brutal. Now what's he gonna do? Is he gonna throw Tiwi Legend? Or is he gonna throw Mahimata? Trying to see how many pills he needs to beat Defunk with, with Tiwi, huh? So he throws Mahimata here. And, um, hmm, I 
Shall we attack with Defunk? Shall we take it with Tanag? Bring it, Mahimata. What you got? Oh, crap. You got a lot. <laughs> okay. Uh, dang it. So I get destroyed yet again on that one. Holy cow. Not playing well today, guys. Not handling the resistance very well. Getting a lot of pushback. Don't like it. So he blasts me for two there. Lose another 29 friggin' points. We've fallen into EFC Tower now, looks like. That sucks. But we're on to game 9 of 10. And we're gonna turn it around, baby. Gonna turn it around, come on. What do we got here? We got Jaguar XJ at Colossus level 121. Um, he has a full hand of Huracan, and I get to go first. So, hmm. Yeah, we need to throw Mamba first here, and I'm going to go in with, um, Gonna go in with three pills, which will just barely get me over the um, their bonus here. So we blast El Factor for two, or no three, I guess. And now what is he gonna come at me with El Tortillo or El Mariachi? It's El Mariachi, so. throw a cubic here. Oh crap. He, he, we drew. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I'll throw Tanak here. Let's see. He's probably going to drill me with El Tortillo. Right. Oh no, he'll just blast, he'll just take it. He'll just blast me with Ray Mono. And now it's all over. Oh my goodness. Well, it was a nice two day, it was a nice two days there. Yesterday and the day before were fantastic. Now reality's slapping us in the face for some reason. So another brutal loss, 29 points, ouch. And we're on to game 10 of 10. Let's see if we can at least finish strong today, shall we? So yeah, I don't really love the Fang P life gainers all that much. Uh, I wish I could use, um, I wish I could use Zhu Tang, but it's not an option, so that's what Defunct's for. He's basically Zhu Tang. Um, so uh, this is GD Pubel here, a Titan level 108, and he throws Lucio at me. So, that's 43 attack. See if that's enough to beat him. Yep. Suck it, Lucio. Booyah! So we open up a six life gap there. That's nice. And um, now he has Tasty Taste activated. So let's see here. Tasty friggin' taste. Let's throw Kusuri with um, two pills. 
If he's a 20 attack, she'll beat him. So he throws his tasty. Oh yeah. Oh wait, she doesn't have her bonus. Oh well, that's all right. So she hits me for, or I hit, I hit him for two. Um, now what? Well now I think I've got him. Rueda Buena can hit me for, um, for a max of seven here, if she furies, but she doesn't. So she hits me for five, and I don't care. And now Pearly can hit me for one. Actually, she can't hit me at all. You can't you can't touch this, Pearl. Booyah! I always want to call Pearl Pearly for some reason. Uh, anyway, there we go. That's game. Sweet. Cubic for the win, baby. We finally get a friggin' win in. So we finished strong. That's good. Pick up 28 points there. Let's go back to the room, shall we? See what we got for daily boxes today. So we're 72nd of uh, EFC Tower. We fell quite a quite a ways there. Almost 100 points. We fell like, what, 80 points? Something like that. Fell down to EFC Tower. Let's see what we got for our daily box here. We got Jennifer, Balixto, Dacha Matcha, Battle Points, Clints, and Cryptos. Nice. I like it. Do I have... I don't think I have Balixto. What is he? He's a Vortex card. Okay. Cool. Alright. Uh, that was nice. Picked up a couple of uncommons there. And last but not least... What do we got here? For a vanilla daily box... We get Judge Scare, Battle Points, Cryptos, and Clints. There we go, guys. Well, I am Hip Hopper. Thank you so much for joining me today for Hoppa's Hip Tips. Please like, subscribe, tell all your friends, and bring them back tomorrow for some more hot, steamy EFC action, my friends. We'll see you then.